Hello YouTube, this is Russian Torts here, and real quick, I want to show you that my dwarf orange Mexican crayfish has eggs. I was gonna say it's pregnant, but really, you don't call them pregnant when they have eggs like that. I don't know what you call them, but I don't know if you can see too well, but the mass, there's a black mass back there. Here, this shows it. Black mass under the tail, and those are a lot of eggs loads of eggs. I don't know how many. A lot. So I left the female in here. I added this plastic fake plant for a cover. It looks really big because of the fishbowl effect but actually it's not that big and I removed the male and put him in his own little tank because the female killed the other male already. I found a dead crayfish in there. I was like crap what's going on. I had the thought like maybe she's pregnant. Not pregnant. Maybe she has eggs. So, yeah, I removed the other male, and I set up a tank for him right here. And there he is, aggressive as always. Every time I approach a tank, he just, like, opens his little pincers, and he acts like he wants to kill me. So he has a little tank here with a air-powered filter. Interesting design. I've never seen this before. Back here, I just picked it up at the pet store. They didn't really have anything else, so I was like, screw it. I'm gonna take it. So I got a sponge filter in there, and that just that tank for the male. Originally, I wanted to put the female in there, but um, moving the female while she had the eggs, I thought was not such a good idea. So I left the female in the other tank. So I think they have a, I guess you call it incubating period of about four weeks. So in three weeks, because she has the eggs for a week now, I was just kind of busy, couldn't make a video. Um, she's gonna have the baby. So I'm gonna go back over here. Oh, you just see her back right now. Anyways, and the tank looks less as always. Um, that up there is all poop from the one single Malaysian trumpet snail that's in here. It's crazy. I'm starting to have some black beard algae form on the plants, so that's bad. I don't really know what I can do against that. The reason is I, I'm not fertilizing this tank because it's shrimp. It's like shrimp, the crayfish. They're invertebrates. You can't fertilize with, with invertebrates. So that's a problem but it's under control right now it's not that much I just don't want it to get too crazy so yeah thank you for watching I'll keep, I'll keep you guys updated on the shrimp babies once they come so yeah if you have any, if you have any questions just leave them in the comment section below thanks